Yes, for sure. Uh, just how it came to, together. We've talked a lot about it, but just through a, a social media connection, just a little outreach from Future, said, I'd like to collaborate with you. And that was the spark. That was the spark that ignited the fire and the light, and now it's so grand. <laughs> Surely, it was just like that, um, and after that, guess what? I brought the, as I always do, I brought the, the, the idea to the group, to the guys. I told them it wasn't something that I was going to do by myself. It wasn't something that we were going to do, the two of us right here. We reached it, uh, we, we sent the idea to everybody. The guys slept over it, and now financially, it, it, it needed to be funded. Adolam atake ume olam Adolam atake we, hit, we, we didn't have enough cakes by then and we didn't have enough money but guess what, these guys are amazing everybody took from their own savings again and they sponsored we we did it and this is exactly your saying and what the chairman said that there is a belief that before you can fix somebody you need to fix yourself and so we thought okay before we can even go and ask for some contribution somewhere let's first contribute then we're gonna go to the next person and say we got so much if you got some if you get you have something please add on top so these guys are the ones who made this thing a reality and i believe on your side also, you got a lot of On my friends. side, oh, um, yeah, I've used a lot of my own money, yeah. but we created together, Ubuntu, which created together a fundraising site. We covered some expenses, but we still have many more expenses to cover, and we're moving forward because we don't stop here. Yes, of course. This is the first stop, South Africa, but we're moving forward. Hopefully next year in Jerusalem, as we say, yes. we, we want to get to America, we want to collaborate with musicians around the world. So we invite people, yeah. musicians, to come. We invite sponsors, benefactors, yeah. yes. uh, philanthropists, anybody to help us out because we're just people making music and, and believing in a dream. And, and from that dream, we created the Healing Light Project. I would like to be honest and to say this to the whole world. I know um, most people somewhere in other places because of the media, they're not sure if um, Africa or, or if Israel other, or if other or Israel or if other African countries are a safe destination. So I'd like to say this on behalf of the group of Mavevane that uh, Africa is a beautiful place and these guys are an amazing team to work with. Uh, so I'd like to call upon anyone who is interested in working with us, I mean organizations, companies, anybody who wants their 
to, to maybe to advertise their company's sort of an advert, we can feature in any activity. Right. So I'm trying to say um, we are growing and we're trying by all means, yes, there are bad things happening in, in, I mean, everywhere around the world. But uh, we can't also be, I mean, considered as if we are one of those people. That's why we are singing, we want to travel the whole world and show people that there are other people who are innocent. But they will be blamed maybe because of one person. There is always good and bad everywhere you go. Your, um, your nephew. People are just people, anywhere you are. <laughs> He's only, how old, 10? Yeah, 10. Yeah. That's 11 years old. And after seeing the concert and seeing yeah. us together, he said, people are just people everywhere in the world. Doesn't <laughs> make From the mouths of the children. Yes. I'll come when we all realize that everyone is equal in God's eyes. Our veins beat into one And I can see the future blazing in the sun I wish you all the love I wish you all the love I wish you all the love in better days Everybody I'd like to just say that after I've spent a, of almost a year in conversation online but we've spent an amazing eight to ten days here and I've seen every home where these guys live, everybody's living a little bit differently in a different suburb, um, some in the city, some in the, in the countryside, and uh, some in, in some of the more dangerous areas. And we have been treated like celebrities. <laughs> and, and if you're going to come here, then you, have to, you just have to come, because these guys are the greatest guys in the world. So just come. travel to the next destination we are working on going to Israel next year in Jerusalem we not, don't know when exactly we are appealing also from the world to help us with some donations we're not looking for huge donations just anything that you you go to will really appreciate it
was the aim and the mission of this whole project, as you saying, people to people is to, to, to continue building it and to continue, I mean, bringing people together. Different from different races, from different colors, from different ethnic groups, to bring everybody together. And we wish the world can recognize this. We are deeply concerned about the wars going on everywhere in the world because what we believe is Ubuntu, which is coming together, we can do more. Thank you very much.